In this video, we're going to focus on how we can remove all the grid lines within the chart area while keeping these tick marks here outside nice in place. So let's start to look how to do this. So let's start to look how to remove the grid lines inside the chart area while we're keeping the lines outside of the chart area, like the ticks or the tick marks intact. So what we're going to do here, first of all, is we go to chartgs3.com, getting started. And this specific link you can find as well in the description box. So once you're on here, scroll down and copy this chunk of code. Copy this. If you want to understand what this code does, watch this video here. So then I'll just paste that in there and I will cut out this title, put the title in here, save, refresh. There we are. So let's maximize the size of it so it's clear to see. Let's put this on 80%, refresh, there we are. So what we want to do is we want to remove these grid lines here and basically to keep these tick marks intact, all we have to do is we have to go scroll down here and then we can do this on the X scale and we have to do it on the Y scale. We say here, grid, because we want to pinpoint the grid lines, but then what we want to say is we want to draw on or remove everything from the chart area and the chart area is within this area and everything outside here, like the scales is not considered a chart area. So we're going to say here, draw on with capital O, chart, area with capital C and capital A. Set this on false, save, refresh. And as you can see here, once we did that, the grid lines on the X scale are being removed while the tick marks here are being shown. So then what we can do is we can copy this, comma, that save, refresh. And now we remove everything within the chart area except for the tick lines here but that is outside the chart area and that's how to do it so if you enjoyed this video and maybe you want to create for example a horizontal scroll bar below here in that case i'm going to recommend you this video here on how to add a horizontal scroll bar effect in chart.js which will make a nice scroll effect on your chart 